This is the new Speed 8 plate python clutch, a successor to our 6 plate clutch. It shares many of the same features and many components. The main change is that we needed the 8 plate to be lighter than the 6 plate. Um, we've made the basket that the corks go into, that's now uh, made of aluminium. It's uh, CNC machined, it's heat treated, it's then double hard anodized to ensure it has a good long lifespan. And we're running a drawn cage needle roller bearing in the center. A steel ring gear is riveted onto that. That's, you can see the extra depth, that's where we're getting the space to be able to fit eight plates in instead of six. To use that, we've then got plates that are compatible with the six. Oh, just to note, that can be used with a six plate clutch. So if you already had an existing six plate clutch and you wanted a different number of teeth, for example, you might choose to buy this crown wheel instead of the uh, um, original version. It's going to work perfectly well and it's lighter than the original. So you'll see the advantage of reducing the weight of your drivetrain. Um, the plates are interchangeable between the two, although obviously this one requires eight instead of the six. The uh, um, clutch uh, spider is longer in order to accommodate the extra plates. The clutch bell is also deeper and we've also put many more positions on it so that it's actually now got um, uh, the load distributed far better than the original design. Um, we're expecting it to be going in powerful stuff. The springs, we've got two different weights available, although for the vast majority of people, the lighter weight will be vastly more than necessary. Same spring, same top bearing, same top cap as the original, and same ability to be able to take the thing apart without actually having to strip it down. Um, it's been running Steve Wright's race bike in Group 6 for some time now. Uh, we've been very pleased with the results. We expect it to be a good upgrade for many people.